What's up, everybody? I don't feel so great today. My mouth's still numb from the dentist. But I got a dog bite e brake. That'd be kind of interesting. Let's go fix it. All right, so we got some ugly carpets and seats are ugly too, really. And old dog got busy. I'll set up a tripod and fix this for you here in a minute. Okay, so <clears throat> to begin with, to begin with, I'm just going to apply some heat and see how this reacts. It feels like hard plastic, so let's shape it a little bit, you know, get it whipped back into shape. I'm going to use the graining pad, the silicone molded pad that I made, one of my favorite grains. <clears throat> Slap uh, to smooth it out real quick, like as it turns out. Uh, I want to heat this plastic without melting this too much right now, so I'm just going to use my own pad as a block as a heat blocker. I'm gonna get this last little piece. If I can. I like to have at least one flat edge on my pads so I can get right on the seam of something. You know, like this. If this is all rounded, it makes it a little bit harder to do what I wanna do. I am <clears throat> not at my best. I feel a little I feel a little under the weather, so it's a raw video. Cause I this is what I'll do. I'll go to work. If I don't feel good or whatever, still gotta work. This is real life. Still gotta perform, right? Mm, getting a little bit uncomfortable with how squishy I got it. You know, I don't want to give up, but. might be a little safer to stop using heat at this point. Oh, I got it a little better. I, you know what, I know I should have a speed control heat or something. But again, this is the raw, this is the raw video. <clears throat> Cause I'll, you know, Using basic tools. Nothing too fancy. Heat gun and a silicone pad. And that is pretty good. I don't feel any, I don't feel anything jagged anymore. Which is one of the concerns with this. Oh, man, I'm scared to touch that. I got coffee gut too, so I'm like I'm jittery. Man, I, you know, I should probably go get something to drink or eat. Because I just uh, overheated it. And so I, I just trimmed around that hole. Now I'm gonna take in a, 
I'm gonna sand it a little bit because I think if I just sand, knock down the, the grain a little, I can, I can probably get it. I might be able, I don't know, we'll see what happens, but I might be able to get away without painting this, which is what I like to do, is not paint things if I don't have to. Well, I'm gonna probably have to paint it anyway because of this thing. I don't even know what I'm gonna do about that yet, but. I got a pile of stuff here. I'm gonna make it happen as quickly as I can. Keep the cost down. Keep the day flowing. Keep the morale up. This is a pretty smooth finish anyway, and so I don't even think I need to grain it. I think if I just, so I'm just this is a Nissan Frontier, uh, 2016, and the dog got a little anxious and stressed, and made the car smell really bad. Got the seats all dirty and chewed the e-brake handle because they loved their owner so much. They wanted to show their affection. All right? Maybe. All right, let's check it out. I'm gonna actually clean that because I don't want to I don't want to uh, melt any dirt into it. Just got my towels just damp with my all-purpose cleaner. It's already looking pretty, pretty snazzy though. If I say so myself. And being a used car on a used car lot, they're probably just fine with this. They didn't even they didn't even think to ask me if I could fix it, to be honest. They asked me if I could deodorize it. Uh, I'm gonna grain it a little bit maybe. I'm gonna grain it some more. You can't I you're zoomed in so you can see those little holes, but there I, I almost can't see them with my head back. They're really, really small. Yeah, you guys are blocking your shot. There you go. Oh. Well, I gotta mess it up. You know what, I, I think I'm gonna just leave it alone at this point. I say that as I'm still doing it. I hope it doesn't put a microfiber print in it because that will happen don't squeeze on soft plastic with the microfiber all right now for the next awkward part uh, it spins that sucks I wonder if it comes out
No. Oh, it does. Ha! Don't be afraid to pull on something and find out. Ooh, I'm about to sit. I'm about to sit there and awkwardly work on this thing for who knows how long. You know, I, I'm, I'm deviating from what I would normally do because I normally would not be trying to show you. And so I would find somewhere better to sand this. But I don't want to keep moving the camera. This is real time, real deal. Uh, I need a little more. I'm going to go right. up here um I say um a lot too I noticed which is dumb but these are not planned videos. I just come to work and show you interesting jobs. And if I want to include insightful information, I say um a lot. Because I'm trying to think of something that may help you. So, I apologize. But it does happen. Okay. Alright. Now, obviously, I'm not done. These are kind of deep. So, because, I'm, okay, I didn't show you. Obviously, I'm not done. These are these are kind of deep, but uh, I'm gonna use some thick super glue. Actually. trying to decide what I want to use. I'm going to go ahead and use the marker balloons. What the heck. Marker balloons kind of interesting. We'll see if it makes us quicker or slower. So I got my marker balloons here. I'm going to back up now or uh, zoom out. I breathe on my finger, put some moisture on it, and it will help this micro balloons stick to your finger and clump together slightly as you're working with it. Otherwise, it, it it's tricky and it wants to just float away with the slightest touch. I've seen people using baking soda in their videos for something like this, but I'm not going to switch my method to baking soda. And what does that tell you? I'll try it, I guess, but I doubt it's going to get a, as good of a result as this does, and it makes a big old mess. All right, I'm gonna risk ruining my towel and use my runny super glue. You see it vaping and reacting and just drying instantly into that powder. Oh, I done did it again. Okay, I almost glued my uh, 15 minutes, man. I almost glued my finger to the to my repair again. It's just kind of something I do. You know what I mean? It's like my fingerprint, my signature on the job, if you will. Like, man, is that a 
Is that a pink and green glove stuck to my dashboard? Oh, <laughs> that's right. We had Jake in here. He was, uh, he left his signet, his calling card. Oh, man. Uh, I'm gonna, you guys, I'm, I'm impatient. We're going to 80 grit. Change your life. Oh, I don't want that. I don't want that. You guys, what's the uh, what's the worst thing ever have what you ever did? Or I don't know. How do I? I don't know. I'll just tell you what I did. One time, it's not the worst thing I did. I don't think, but it was crappy. One time, I went to the bathroom with a set of keys. It had two sets of keys for a Volvo XC. 70 or whatever they're called and uh, as I was flushing the toilet they slid off the top and they actually flushed all the way down I um, took the toilet off the floor and they weren't in there they weren't in the pipe they weren't in the floor they flushed and they were a big set of keys $700 it cost me to get the car towed to Volvo and have them make the keys so that day, it's definitely were not too profitable. So I was just wondering if what happened, what what have you had happen to you like that? Now, I, it's getting pretty good, but it's still got a little bit of crack, uh, a little bit of a divot there, and let's let's get it better. So I'm gonna use my thick super glue because this stuff tends to uh, it's, it's runny but it's not water runny and so you can see it runs it's running and it will it will flow so if you just put it on and tap it look how glossy and nice that finishes that's what it does that's what it does so this stuff here oh I put the wrong stuff on there just now uh, specifically I use on my finished layers when I'm using super glue and you know you don't super glue is what it is but what else are you gonna do this with you know if you don't use super glue uh, uh, tell me what you got you know what I mean because I don't know how else I would do this uh, and you know it's relatively timely fashion gonna look pretty good and I don't think it's coming off of there you guys I've you know I've used this stuff for a long time and it once it dries it's a pretty solid affair oh calling card Got a little chunk of my glove in there you see my pink gloves on your lot like man Jake's around here dude Jake is he's he's moved into our area no I'm, I'm not going anywhere uh, yeah I don't do this a lot I've done a few but as far as and I wish I could my finger fit in there and I could just there we go, that's better. Oh, come on, this is awkward. For a guy who's not eating anything today. Like I said, I'm not I'm not 100% today, boys and girls. It's almost three o'clock. Uh, I've been doing this for a few minutes now. I'm going to go paint this a random gray color because I don't really care. 
I could just paint it brown, I'll paint it, I'll paint it gray. I'll probably use a, just a solvent paint, you know. This paint job isn't going to be the best. I guess that's one downside. I don't know how to get paint to stick real well to something like that. But, you know, whatever, man. They didn't even ask me to do it. They just know that I do stuff like this. All right. All right. All right. I hit it with some Bulldog Adhesion Promoter. Just so I can say I tried. And uh, we're going to shoot it with uh, just a rattle can of silver or gray metallic interior trim. Oh man, it's got a bad nozzle. That's not going to be good. Anyway, decided to paint it silver with a spray can. I'm going to let that dry and we'll, jump, we'll pop in there and look at it. Okay. <clears throat> it's a good call on the gray metallic because it matches pretty good. It's not perfect. Uh, but I'm not going for perfect. I'm going for... Um, take your eye off it, give it a longer life, make it more usable. And uh, when you stand back like this and you open the door, it doesn't look all mangled. So put it down, paint didn't slide off, ready to go. Parking it. <clears throat> all right, thanks for watching the video. Stick it till the end. Hit the like and subscribe, maybe even the notification bell. I think they're all three broken. Don't go being the hero, trying to fix it, pushing it a bunch of times. Anyway, just joking around. Uh, have a good day, guys. Hope that helped you out or entertained you or whatever.